Are lithium ion batteries dangerous? Well, they can be. Let's look at the science behind why. It has to do around a phenomenon known as thermal runaway. Thermal runaway is a reaction that happens internally to the battery where the organic electrolyte reacts spontaneously with oxygen. That can cause a highly exothermic reaction, release a lot of heat, and ultimately result in a fire. When a battery is in conventional operation, there is no oxygen in the system. But if the battery gets very, very hot, the cathode can shed oxygen. Now inside the battery, we have oxygen and an organic electrolyte at a high temperature, and that can cause a reaction that ultimately results in a fire, and that is what thermal runaway is. So in what cases would you have a very hot temperature inside the battery? It could be a short circuit inside the battery. It could be that the battery was charged too high. It could be the battery had metal plating because it was discharged too low and then recharged rapidly. The battery was charged too fast in a cold climate. There's a number of things that can happen that can cause these high temperatures to occur. That's why we put a BMS or a battery management system on our batteries. We don't allow for these things to happen. We don't allow for very high current cold temperature charging. We don't allow for short circuits to happen. We've got thermal cutoff so that if it's too hot, it doesn't continue to operate. All of these mechanisms are in place to prevent thermal runaway. Now, having said that, there are some chemistries that are more prone to thermal runaway. That is, it's easier to produce oxygen off of a cathode in an electric vehicle battery or a laptop battery or a cell phone battery. These are more energy dense systems that are based on metal oxides, typically a cobalt oxide or a, a nickel manganese cobalt oxide. The oxygen can come off of that material at lower temperatures. For lithium iron phosphate, it needs to be extremely hot for that oxygen to come off of the cathode, forming a potentially dangerous situation in the batteries. Another thing that we do to mitigate the uh, potential for thermal runaway is for lithium iron phosphate, we use small cylindrical cells with very high heat transfer so that if energy or heat is generated internally, that heat can dissipate before it gets hot enough so that the oxygen is shed from the cathode. So there's a number of things that can be done to take a potentially dangerous cell and make a very safe system, and that is a number one priority at Dragonfly Energy.